This mask is Ramin's new mask, especially for the 25th anniversary, which we've altered slightly from his existing mask, because it's always kind of good to play with details, really. And also the makeup's changed a little bit, and the mask has to fit exactly over the makeup. From a performance point of view, it has to do that. But also from a technical sound point of view, from his microphones and things, it has to sort of look good. And it also very much has to enhance Ramin's face in that it, the idea is that the Phantom has tried to make himself look extraordinarily attractive and masculine and handsome. And so the, the, his way of doing it is the mask. And the original concept of this, which came from Marie Bjornsson, was that because of the period, he'd actually made this in fine porcelain. Although technically, of course, we don't use porcelain. That's the overall image of the thing, that he's made this mask particularly to make himself to hide this gruesome sort of uh, distortion in the rest of his face. We also spend a lot of time making sure that the, the shape of the mask works really well as a sculptural item in itself, because at the point where Christine pulls the mask off, it becomes an object in itself. It's no longer a mask, it's also uh, a sculptural object.